Alrighty folks, you're getting shop update from home today. Uh, so today I had to run over to Coleman, grab a couple parts, run over to Athens, grab vape juice. Unfortunately, I have a long trip about every three weeks. It's about a two hour round trip to get vape juice because there's nobody who can modify it near me who has the menthol extract I need. Uh, I need to figure out what menthol extract it is. But anyway, I'm picky. Uh, I do it once every three weeks. Came back to the shop. Pulled some fuel out of Rob Clemens' bike because the flex fuel sensor was reading 67% and I really didn't trust it. No, it's dead on 67%. So, drained all the fuel out because I want to turn the boost up, but I don't want to turn it up on 67%. I want to turn it up on 85% and I want to be sure the 85% is right. Plus, I'll be able to see if the scaling's good. So, put Freshy in it. Got up to, I think it was like 78, 79%. I want a little more, so drained it out again. I'm going to put another five gallons in that I picked up today, tomorrow. Get it back on the dyno, and we're going to go for the big numbers tomorrow. Turn it all the way up, iron out the E85, and we will be ready to rock and roll on that. Uh, let's see, where are we going from there? Do, 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 do. Uh, hooped your Hicks motors, put together, I tinkered with that in between while I was draining fuel and such. Uh, he needs a crank sensor. Uh, it was borrowed for another customer's bike. Well, another customer's bike. The guy who owned the motor borrowed the crank sensor out of it for his bike before he sold that motor that was in the crate in the corner to Hoopty for me to build to be able to put in Hoopty's bike. Big loop-de-loop. -loop. Anyway, that one's about done. It's sitting on the bench. Uh, let's see, what else did I work on today? Not a whole hell of a lot else. It was not a super productive day, but it was an errand day. Uh... Had to run and get a bunch of parts and stuff. I did get hearing protection for the shop again. So we now have hearing protection available. It goes all the way down to youth size. I have fit them on a two-year-old. All the way up to adult. I wear the same ones. And they are freaking awesome. Uh, that's about all we got going on other than the fuel tech sale, guys. If you're interested in the fuel tech, hit me up. Uh, oh, the swing arm came in for the Colorado bike. Still waiting on the transmission. Need to send an email out to Rob Bush. Figure out what's going on with that. Must be a vendor issue. It probably is. Rob Bush isn't late like that. He's freaking awesome. So, don't know what's up with that. Uh, but yeah, that's about all I got going on. Later, guys. Hope you enjoyed the update. It ain't much today.